What's up, YouTube? It's your boy, it's your homie, Futuristic Mike, and I'm back with another Power Book 2 Ghost video if you're new. Now, we're going to be talking about Crystal Ball possibly returning for Power Book 2 Ghost Season 2. If you're a fan of power, if you love power, hit the like on this video. If you're new to my channel and this is the first time you're finding me, subscribe and turn on those post notifications so when I post videos on Power Book 2 Ghost, you get them. Now, Power Book 2 will soon return for its second season, and fans are keeping their fingers crossed for some surprise cameos from the original series, Power Book 1. Hopefully a lot of original characters are coming back. We already seen some appear in Power Book 2 Ghost Season 1, like Blanca Rodriguez, Tamika, 2-Bit, but hopefully there's more in Power Book 2 Ghost Season 2. We've seen that Ghost butted heads with rival dealer Cristobal throughout seasons 2 through 5 in the original Power series. A casting clue seems to have confirmed his return. If you go on IMDb and you go to Power Book 2 Ghost Season 2, it shows Cristobal in the casting. So we know that he's going to be returning, probably, most likely. The cast list for Power Book 2 Ghost appears to have revealed Cristobal will return as an antagonist for the spin-off's upcoming second season. Now despite enrolling at Stansfield University, Tariq is keeping one foot in the drug world after striking up a partnership with Queenpin Monet Tejada. However, the rising star in New York's criminal underground still has enemies everywhere trying to take him down. You know, he has enemies everywhere. Even Tommy Egan, your boy Tommy Patrick Egan came back and he was beefing with Tariq. Mostly Tasha, but he was beefing with Tariq as well. It looks like Matt Sedino, who played Cristobal, is set to appear in the third episode of Power Book 2 Ghost Next Installment Season 2. Of course, the casting info has been provided by IMDb, which isn't always accurate when it comes to unreleased episodes, so we really don't know. In my opinion, I think it would make a lot of sense to bring Cristobal back into the fold at this point in Tariq's career and his drug game. The leader of the Hermanos Tainos still has unfinished business with 2-Bit, we know that for a fact, and 2-Bit tied himself to Tariq in Power Book 2 Ghost's first season. I think Cristobal could be released in season 2 and try to make a deal with Monet's husband, Lorenzo, or a new drug lord for season 2. Even Matt Sedino himself posted on Instagram, pretty much hinting that his character is gonna make a comeback. He said, remember this duo, what the fuck happened to Cristobal anyway, prison for life? So that pretty much hints at Cristobal coming back sometime in the future and he's listed in the casting. So it's pretty much confirmed at this point, but Courtney Kemp herself and 50 Cent and all of them, they didn't confirm it. You know how they release news to Deadline and all these other articles saying that people are coming back as a series regular and stuff. Pretty much like Effie's character and Jenny Sullivan and stuff like that. How they recently released that news. They didn't say nothing about Matt Sedino. So it's not actually confirmed. But since his name is on IMDb and other sources, people are thinking that Cristobal is going to make a comeback. And I think it would be a good thing for Cristobal to come back. It would definitely be nice to see his character because we haven't seen his character since the end of season five. So it would definitely be nice. Um, we know that he's doing Tyler Perry's Ruthless right now. He's playing the highest on BET Plus. So he's busy with that. I don't know what other projects he's doing. So hopefully he will make a return. What do you guys think about Cristobal coming back to Power Book 2 Ghost? What do you guys think about this? Comment your thoughts down below. Keep supporting your boy, and I'll be continuing to bring y'all Power Book 2 Ghost content in the future. Make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe, and smash that notification bell so you can never miss a video. If you guys want to donate to the channel, I got links below to the PayPal and Cash App accounts. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Let me get out of here, y'all. It's your boy, Futuristic Mike, and I'll talk to you on the next one. I'm out. Peace.